Well, many congratulations. Thank Another you. championship win in, in your category. How proud are you to have to achieve this? Oh, he just he just makes me well up every time I talk about him. He's he's just he is just a hero to me. Like he gives me he's one of those ponies, he just gives me everything on the day. You know, there's not many days I come away and I'm disappointed. But to come back, you know, UK two years ago, then you come back two years down the line, you've still got to get it right. Um, yeah. So what? So what, how did it click today? Um, I, I do it with every other show. I, I prepare the same. Nothing ever changes. He was. He won in 2017 and was champion. He came last year and jumped another amazing clear and was third. And you know, some days you just come out and you know you just. And again, he jumped another amazing clear. Um, in my opinion, this year he jumped the best clear he's jumped so far and then when you come into the main arena and you've got all the other winners of the category yeah. there what were you thinking he just loves it he goes in he's no earplugs he's no karmas he's nothing he just thrives off an atmosphere you know he just seems like hoys is his he just loves he thinks everybody's here to watch him and how much i mean this is not your full-time profession no. producing what, what, what's your normal day job so um me and my sister are both hairdressers um, so tomorrow we'll be doing a 12 hour shift <laughs> due to um, being off from the salon on Wednesday, Thursday. So we'll be putting a full day in tomorrow um, and Saturday and then we'll be back Saturday afternoon. So the good ladies of Burnley are waiting for you? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> We've had a few messages. Nobody's answering the phone. So, you know, when we're going to book in. Yeah. yeah. And to be at Horse of the Year show, is it, it's the ultimate for you and your sister? Oh, absolutely. I mean, I know everybody works hard to get here. I'm not saying, I'm not saying we work any harder than everybody else. But to juggle work, we both have small children. Um, we both have houses to look after. We have a normal, trying to juggle a normal life as well as trying to strive for success. You know, some days it's difficult and you think, is it really worth it? But then when there's, you have days like today, you think, you know, it was all worthwhile. Okay, I've got one question for you. Yeah. As a hairdresser, how do you solve the hat hair problem for riders? <laughs> Dry shampoo. <laughs>